today I'm going to show you how I curl my hair for an everyday look. I actually curl my hair twice a week. That's because the girl will stay in for two days, which is pretty awesome. Um, I start off with, uh, the night before with washing my hair and putting in my smooth and chic on my wet hair. This product protects your hair against heat and at the same time it's an anti frizz lotion. For me it really works. I'm not sure what other people think about but you can't really go wrong with an anti frizz lotion and a protecting heat serum in one. And then before I start curling my hair, the next morning I use this hair protecting serum. I'm not sure if they still sell it in the stores or at the hairdresser because it's pretty old but if they do let me know because it's amazing and it actually really put and I actually already put it in my hair before I started filming that's why my hair is a lot shinier than normal <laughs> I'm now going to show you how I curl my hair but before I do that I will put in this conditioner that's because uh, my curls will be softer if I do and I'm also going to section my hair so yeah keep watching Uh, for a review check out my blog because I wrote a review on it obviously otherwise you didn't have to, to check out my blog. I'm putting it on 180 degrees and I prefer to hold my curling iron like this while I curl my hair. You know, like this. It's kind of if you're going to stab someone with it. Like in those vampire movies or series they're always like eh. <laughs> um, no, but for real, I'm not going to step anyone with it, only my hair. So I'm holding it like this. Now first take a section. Voilà. make my curls uh, stay like they are when I just curl them and giving them a nice shine. It's a lot better than hairspray actually because it looks a lot more natural. Also hairspray makes my curls really heavy which I'm sure the curls to droop and nobody wants that to happen so I'm using this. <laughs> This was my hair tutorial. I hope you're going to try it or if you have any tips for me leave them in the comments below and I will see you next time with a Julia's Fashion Minute with this pink blazer and yeah check out my blog for the list of products I used in this tutorial and uh, thanks for watching bye bye